guys, it's me Melissa and welcome back to my channel. Today we got another Rom Wee, Rom Way, Rom whatever you want to call it, haul. Now this is actually two separate orders. So if you don't know about Rom Wee, I shop a lot on it. I like to find the what's going on in their lightning deals that they have, like usually two or three, sometimes four a day of these different lightning deals you could choose from. Now I have found that some now will only let you buy one at a time and then others will let you buy 10 at a time. So obviously I don't buy any when it's just one. Um, so these are two orders. I have placed another order. I like, I like it. I mean, I feel like I saved some money. And with all of these, like I do my daily check-in every day so that I will gain points to where I could take it off of the money that I spent. So when I tell you the price is, is exactly what I spent with the discounts off um, than what it would have been if you bought it right now on the site, if it is still available, you know. Um, I'll put a link down below if you want to check it out. Um, I think you get some sort of discount when you use that code. It gives me $5 off $30, but a lot of times I don't spend $30, but it's good to have them just handy. I think this past order, I did spend over 30 and use my points and comboed it up. So the first half is going to be like straight up like clothing and the stuff that's on the the lightning deals. And then the second half of the order is going to be, the second order is going to be us trying to figure out some new lighting. We'll go into all that later on. Okay, without further ado, let's see what I got. So this, I paid 35 cents for it and it would have been 95 cents. So it's supposed to be anklet. Take them out or anklet. There's supposed to be two, isn't there? Are they connected together? So they stuck them both together, but there's two. So there's this one, anklet, and they're adjustable, obviously. And then this anklet, whoop, wrong way. This anklet. Now I always say that I want to wear anklets. So I figured this is a way for me to like, try it out. I'm not gonna try it out right now. How is it hooked on here? Oh wait, just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> this is one anklet. <laughs> See, I just, I just buy stuff, and before I know it, I'm like, what did I get? Like, this stuff shows up, and I'm just, I'm, usually I buy these orders late night when I'm laying in bed, right before I go to bed. So then, like, the next morning, I totally forgot what I got. So this is one bracelet, one anklet, and it goes together. More reasonable. Does it fit me? I mean, obviously it fits me because it has the adjustable thing, and then if I wanted to, I could just take off any of the extra ones so it doesn't, like, dangle. I don't think I like the dangling. But yeah, so I'm going to keep this. Hopefully I'll wear it. We shall see. It seems like it should be... Oh, it does. It bends pretty easily. Because it was kind of bent the opposite way. So I just bent it a little bit this way. So it'll be more like... Like your your ankle. <laughs> Alright, this next one. I don't know. I just keep buying masks. Only because, like, with my discount, this was 40 cents. And then regularly is $1.45. They come in these nice bags. I really do like these bags. You can use them to put your masks in. Or just to, like, have them until you're ready to use them. Well, this one's different. It's like almost, I mean, I don't use these ones a lot. I guess they're like a silky, but it also has a squish to it. Does like the adjustables here. I don't usually buy these ones. I couldn't tell what material it was. That's really comfy. I mean, who knows how long we wear a mask. <laughs> I see a mask, it's super duper cheap, I buy it. I mean, 40 cents, this is, different how it's like like squishy i've seen i've seen the material like this like this material but they're always like really really thin but you see how this has almost like a layer in between like a foam layer i guess that's more protection too i'm not hating that I'm not hating that at all and now the last three items are going to be um clothing items and then i said we'll get on to their stuff so let's check out these shorts so they had jean shorts on the lightning deals. Now they're not like wicked, wicked cheap, but still seem like reasonable. I went by what they said. Now I'm not super hopeful for these. Like I somehow feel like I'm not gonna like them. I think because the way my body's shaped, like shorts are really hard for me, but I really have wanted new pairs of shorts. So this I paid four dollars and two cents for, and on the site they're uh six ninety-five. And like I said before, Shein is like Romwe is the sister company of Shein, like the cheaper one. I think where all the stuff goes that um like the clearance items, the more cheaper stuff. And I can't get in it because there's no zipper thing at the top. So I'm going to show you both these pairs of shorts. What size did I get? Alright, so I got a small because it said to get a small. 
but they're definitely wider at the bottom. This seems like one of those styles that the younger people are wearing now. I don't know if I'm gonna feel super comfortable in it, but these are them. They're jean shorts. I'm not sure about this. I literally checked the size chart like multiple times because I was like, should I? Because some people said like I sized up and then they were too big. So I got a small. I mean, work comes to worse, I could probably, does it have like a tag on it? There's no real tag on it, but I could probably try to sell them if they don't fit me. So there's that pair. And then this I paid $3.59 after my, using my points. And it would have been $12.95. Also a size small. We're going to cross our fingers. <laughs> now this is a more of a color I would normally wear. Now see, that seems like more reasonable to fit than these ones do. But yeah, so these are almost, they seem like a little more wide like too. They feel legitimately like jeans. Now you're not going to get a pair of jean shorts anywhere for that price. The 12 something, yes. But with using my points like that much off, no, you're not getting that. And then the last item, I got this in an extra large and I paid $1.54 and it would have been $5.95. And this is just a bodysuit. Oh, that's big. <laughs> that seems big. I say that things seem big and then it won't be big at all. It is very soft. It's like a mixture material with a cotton and like spandexy, whatever you want to call it. And yes, it has the buttons at the bottom. So if you have to go to the bathroom, you can just unsnap the buttons. I was worried about this. I, I've thought about buying bodysuits before, but I was like, oh my gosh, if I have to take off my shorts and my whole entire outfit to go to the bathroom, that seemed like a lot. But if these snap, that's pretty nice. Do you normally wear underwear when you wear a bodysuit or do you just wear the bodysuit? It would be really uncomfortable having those buttons like right in that area. Just saying, I don't know. Okay, so let's try on the shorts and then maybe I'll put on this with a pair of the shorts so we can kind of see it together because obviously I wouldn't be wearing this without a pair of shorts. All right, let's try them on. So here are a pair of shorts, number one. They're a little tight. <laughs> They're a little tight, for sure high-waisted. Maybe if I would have got a medium, they wouldn't have been high-waisted, but I feel like they look better anyway. If they weren't high-waisted, the crotch would be laid down to here. I, as you know, I'm not big on the high-waisted because I'm not used to wearing high-waisted, but this is a kind of high-waisted world. And it is true that it kind of hides all that like situation all in here. I don't know, what do you think? I mean, I, don't, I think they're like a, even like a good length. Sometimes I'll cut these and unroll them if, if they're too short. I'm surprised the small fit me, especially with all the things that I've gotten off of Romley and all these sites, then had to get like extra, extra large in them. And they feel like really legit jeans. I'm kind of impressed. Now, like if you were, if you were like that, could you just like then put like a crop top on? But I hate like if you put a crop top on and then you sit down and you get that like roll. I'm not all about that. But okay. All right. These aren't bad. Okay. Let's check out number two. And here is number two. I mean, pretty much the same. <laughs> it's pretty much the same pair of shorts almost, but a darker color. I mean, I prefer my shorts to be laid down to here. But isn't it bad? I guess I can pull it out a little bit, but if you pull it, it does start that like sagging thing right here, which you don't really want. So you kind of want to have it up high. I mean, for the price I paid. Now what I, what I, I mean, I guess these are worth, I mean, if they're, if they're a pair of jeans and you want a high waist pair of jeans and you want them to, you know, do this, it wouldn't be a bad deal to pay not $12 or I think there was like 10 or something dollars for the price that I got. And that's not bad. Only, and like I said, I might cut this part. And sometimes if you cut it, you can roll them down a little bit more. Actually, I did that on the other pair of shorts that I have, but my shorts. So I'm going to put those shorts on with the bodysuit and then we can kind of see a little bit more kind of what it looks like. And here is the bodysuit with a pair of shorts on. And these are the shorts I was telling you about. Like these are shorts I kind of wear a lot. They're more like form fitting, but they are longer and I cut the side so that it just rolled back down. I definitely should have gotten a size large, but am I hating the fact that it's a little bit bigger? I'm not. Now the cut on the bottom part is almost like into a thong, which is good because I wear thongs. So it's not like something will be like riding up my butt all the time. I was worried it was going to be out like this and like leave a panty line. This is something I'm not normally used to wearing. A bodysuit is not something that I would normally go and pick up. I know they are fashionable but it's not something I would normally buy because I feel 
like your focus a little more towards this area and I'm not really big chested. I feel like if you're really big chested, you can pull these off a little bit better. But I might hate it. Maybe if I had like a little jacket or something on or like a zip up over it, it I would feel like more comfortable in it. I do like the tie dyeness of it. So soft. It really is super duper soft. Like I'm impressed at how soft it is. Don't mind my bra. I guess I wonder what bra you wear with this. Maybe a black bra? Maybe a white bra? I don't know. So, I mean, I feel like I got what I paid for with the clothing, for sure. I mean, the clothing quality was great. All right. Let's go check out the other stuff. I mean, not bad. The shorts were high waisted, but I knew they were going to be. But they're good quality. That bodysuit probably could have got a size smaller, but it still was super comfy. I did put my regular shirt back on because I wanted to be as most comfortable as possible, not to see my bra sticking out 24-7. All right, second half of the video. Now, when I was putting on this bed set, the whole goal was to put up these lights that I got from Romwe a while ago. Well, two of the things just flung out that are on the metal pieces flung out, no clue. Like... I was up here for 45 minutes trying to find it. The only thing I think it, could do, it did was fly behind the, the bed frame the, on the wall. That's the only thing I can think of that went back there. And because it's actually mounted to the wall, like I'll never be able to get it. Unless two people want to take it off the wall. And that just seems like too much work for me. Which is sad because I did like these. That's the reason I also don't have the lights on in the flowers. Because I'm planning on getting rid of the flowers and then changing things around or maybe leaving them there but without lights in them. I don't know. We're just going to try to figure things out. So now I can finally throw these away because that was totally an epic fail. So I bought three sets of lights for us to test out. I was going to do this completely by myself and I was going to be like, mostly try out these lights and then pick what you want. But then I was like, hey, I'll buy three, put them up, Kind of like let you guys see what each of them look like. Kind of like mock up, mocked up there. And then try to figure out which ones the best are. Or if they look all look great, then at least I can switch them out here and there. And have different color lights and different like patterns of lights in the background. So this one also, I use my points to try to get it down to $9.90 so I can get free shipping. And so this would have been, I paid $3.56 and it would have been $4.45. I'm going to show you them all. And then we'll light them all up. So these are purple. So they're, 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 they'll light up, they'll light up lighter than this in the picture it did. But they're like fabric, like squishy kind of thing. And the reason I like these the best was they all had where you put batteries in it. These ones back here have those like CR whatever wash batteries. And those like drive me insane. Like they go out so quick. And I really just didn't want to buy anymore. I was like completely done buying them. All right, this one I paid three dollars and seventeen cents for, and it would have been three ninety five. And this one's a little bit different too; it has flowers, but also like greenery. So I'm gonna probably leave those up when we test these out, but maybe picture them not there. And this one only takes two, compared to the other one takes three. So it's like a bind. Like I guess you'll see them all. And then this one I paid three dollars and seventeen cents, and on the side is three ninety five. And also there's a chance, part fell down there, if, if there's a chance that like if one of these looks good but they're not really long enough, maybe we want to go all the way around, I could buy a second one of, of any one of these on my next, next runway order and then we can have more. So these are like little flowers and they're like silicone-y. Huh. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to <clears throat> like lightly tape them up, like I'm just going to use this washi tape I have back there. Whatever it looks like will not be the exact look of what it would be later. It will be more like streamlined and cute looking. But this is going to be kind of for us to check and see what we think. All right, without further ado, let's try out the first one. So here's number one. I actually did take the flowers down so we can kind of see what it would look be like without the flowers. I thought the flowers were cute. <clears throat> I'm actually thinking about getting something to go right here like succulents to go on there and get rid of the cheap chick thing. There's all these things that changes I think I want to do, but who knows? So this is the first one, obviously not up there perfectly. And I can kind of see that maybe having two and going all the way around might be a better thing to do than just having a thing across the top. But I'm gonna let you guys kind of tell me what's what. So that's number one, these are the purple hearts. You can't really tell they're hearts at all. Up close you can, but not from here. All right, that's a lot of work. All right, time for number two. 
And as we've seen with number two, <laughs> it is extremely short. So this is probably going to, even though it's kind of cute, it's probably going to be a no-go because I would probably have to have, especially even if I was only going to do half, like I'd have to do two on each side just to get one full over. And then probably, I'd have to probably get four in order to make it go all the way around. And wasn't that the most expensive one? Did I not check the dimensions? I'm just going to put that like maybe on the banister downstairs or something, but. So this, this is a regular where we got one no. This, not hating this one, but we got one no. <laughs> and now for the last one. I am hoping for this one. I do think it looks cute. So I'm going to hope for this one, but we shall see. All right. Now for number three. And here is number three. Yet again, from where you guys are, you really can't tell that they're little flowers. And yet again, don't judge me on how they're up because I just literally threw them up. This is like my third set of stuff trying to throw up there. Would it look cuter if it went all the way around? Should I get one more of these and one more of those? I'm torn. I'm not really good about this whole decorating thing. I know a lot of people have said over time, like, you should do this. You should do that. I just, I'm very a basic person. I don't like to do too, too much. Like people said I should put stuff on the wall back here. But I just can't even think about that. Because obviously it has to be either something small to where you can see it perfectly. Or it'll only be half in and half out. I don't know. I'm just not really a good decorator. Let's say succulents I'm thinking right here. A little succulent action. Probably fake succulents. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm kind of over the flowers. We're like with the flowers up with these lights. Now we got flowers and lights. No flowers. <laughs> lights. This is a lot. <laughs> Maybe little type of things up there. I don't know. This is a lot going on. And even I've seen people do, like, since I have slatted, you could do, like, these across, but the whole way across on, like, one, two, and then three slats. Help me out. I'm going to take all this stuff down, and I'm not going to do anything until, like, after this video comes out, and then I'll decide if I buy one more of these, two more of these, two more of those. There can be zero more of these bought. I feel like this video might be all over the place and not like showing you how my brain works, which is sometimes a little bit crazy. It can sometimes do its own thing. Now that I said that thing about the multi-slats, I'm kind of thinking that too. Would there be too many lights? Will somebody hate me when they come like sleep over and there's like slats and stuff everywhere? Like the lights on them. I don't know. I do need your help. <laughs> Now, does that mean, obviously, I know you guys are going to give me a lot of great tips. Doesn't mean I'm going to take every single tip and make it happen. But I sometimes can use a little help. And today's the day. This is a very strange and unorthodox Romway, Romway haul today. But instead of just doing a video, like I was just going to do a video just on this. And I had that small little order, so I figured I might as well just put them both together. <laughs> make one video. And I also do have another Romway on the way. On the way. So if I do all this stuff, it'll be the next order after that, unless I order again before this video comes out, because who knows? Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> so if you like this video, give it some thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, which I know you do, please put them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you haven't yet subscribed, I mean, maybe this video would make you want to, but I have other ones that are much more fun and funny and good times. So go ahead and subscribe. Because the next one might be your favorite. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.